this will be the beginning of the video. Is there a difference between a full frame lens and a crop lens on a crop body? Let's find out. This is our collection of lenses with our labels. This one is Samyang 35mm designed for full frame camera, full frame sensor. This is Sony 35mm but it's created for crop sensor APCS. So we know there is exist crop factor 1.5 times. We don't know where it applies. We have three lenses, Sony, Samyang, and we have kit lens from Sony. I created this label, so one will be Samyang 35 millimeters, second will be Sony 35 millimeters, and right now, first we try Sony 16 to 15 millimeters. Idea is I will put all of them in the same situation, so we'll have the same configuration for all lenses. It will be nice to compare picture quality on all of them as well. Now I have it in 35 millimeter, aperture 5.6, shutter speed 150. Uh, okay. I saw 1600. Click. First picture. Picture number two without me. From Sony 16 to 50. Okay, now we will use. Now oh, it goes Sony lens. 35. Everything okay? I forgot to put label. Sony 35 millimeter. We have two pictures. Now, last lens what we're testing is uh, Samyang full frame. Samyang full frame. Okay. The same settings. Uh, I saw 1600. Aperture 5.6. One of fifth, one of fifth of a second. Shutter speed. 10 second delay. Okay, we have all pictures from these three lenses, but we also have opportunity to test Canon. Uh, we have Canon uh, 6D, this is full frame camera, and this is Canon 700D, is cropped sensor. Okay, Canon 50mm full frame lens. So now we will know results. Oh. Canon 24, 105 millimeter. Final lens is big one, Sigma 24, 70. This is final picture we're making from Canon. Done. We still don't know, now we need to go and check pictures on laptop. Uh, we d downloaded pictures to the laptop. We have not checked the result yet. So let's reveal the results. <laughs> Samyan. Next one. Sony. 16 to 50. Do we see difference between kit lens and Samyan? So two fixed lenses. Samyan. Sony, Samyang, Sony, Samyang, Sony. There is difference. There is a difference. But difference is very small. It's not 1.5, is it? It's not 1.5 at all. This is, there is difference. It is small difference. So I would say correct answer. There is no difference. If we use uh, Samyang and, so, uh, and Sony, Samyang, it's even smaller difference. Of course, if we will be very precise, there is small difference. So 35 full frame lens is exactly provides the same picture as 35 millimeter lens designed for cropped sensor. There is quality difference. There is full frame can cover full sensor, but it does make difference if you will buy one or another. Let's go and take a look what is the difference with Canon. Let's take a look on our results. Canon for designed for cropped sensor. So this only lens what we have is designed for cropped sensor. We tried as accurate to make 50 millimeter because this is all of them can do. 
and reveal of truth difference with canon ef is full frame lens okay i, I think it's slightly tilted it's not significant it's not 1.5 crop next one this is for example two fixed 50 can if cheap one mm -hmm. because i have this one cheap one 1. 1.8 mm -hmm. this one and your more expensive one looks really no big difference here it just slightly tilted camera mm -hmm. I think there's something going on, but uh, not not uh, not one point five. Okay, and uh, no one can guarantee you that they can make so precise lenses. Uh, Sigma. Okay, but we can confirm two things. There is small difference between all lenses. All of them was adjusted to fifty five millimeters, and all of them are different. In this case, let this is full frame. In this full frame, this one is f uh, one point eight. This is cheaper lens. This is more expensive, cheaper. Okay, these two are very close. So, conclusion. You can use full frame lens on crop sensor. You can use designed lens on crop sensor. So, for all practical purposes, there is no difference. There you have it.